Aaron, Benjamin, Eric, John, Matthew, and Nathaniel Jackson abused the victim for years, starting when she was just four. Police also charged the brothers' parents, John and Nita, saying they failed to stop the abuse. Ten of your sides, Liz Palka is live in North Carolina now with more on what happened today. Liz? Nicole, the victim was here in court today. The now 17-year-old addressed all six Jackson brothers, many of whom have now pleaded guilty to sex crimes against her. She thanked those who brought the case to light, especially the oldest brother, Eric Jackson. She also told the Jacksons, forgiveness is not mine to give. That's up to God. Eric Jackson is the first person who came forward to admit to these sexual assaults within his home. We learned today the assault started with him. The district attorney says eventually all the brothers got involved. The victim said in interviews the assaults sometimes happened two to three times per week. At one point, Nita Jackson witnessed it, and the victim believed she would go to hell if she told anyone about it. Through tears, Eric and Matthew Jackson, the two oldest brothers, asked for her forgiveness today. They apologized and said they have pledged to make the situation right. Eric and Matthew pleaded guilty to first degree sex offense. They've both been sentenced to 12 to 15 years in prison. Nathaniel and Benjamin are facing multiple incest charges and have now pleaded guilty to them. They will serve two years in jail and get 36 months probation. John Mark's case was continued to July, but he is expected to plead guilty then. And Aaron's case will go to trial. He did not accept the plea deal. Now, Nita and John Jackson, the parents, were both in court today. They had a bond hearing. They were denied bond, so they will stay in jail for now. And we understand they will be back in court in August. Live in Perk Women's County, I'm Liz Palka, 10 on your side.